Are you excited for the CCNP Enterprise Track, the new next level CCNP from Cisco Systems? Well, here at IT Pro TV, we're excited as well. And in this critical update, we've got some exciting news regarding the CCNP Enterprise. So we know that Cisco Systems has many different CCNP tracks, but the CCNP track that is going to be by far the most popular is none other than the CCNP Enterprise. This CCNP covers key technologies that you would want to master in order to build a really highly available, scalable, automated type of enterprise infrastructure. And in this critical update, we're here to tell you that Ronnie Wong and myself have officially completed all of the materials that you would need for your CCNP Enterprise certification. But before we get into what we've just finished, we wanted to make sure you were aware of some of these other next level certifications that are waiting for you and are completed as well. Ronnie Wong was the subject matter expert for the incredible CCNA video series here at IT Pro TV. And you can see the many topics that Ronnie covered in those episodes. So if you are worried perhaps that you don't have that strong foundation in Cisco before you move to the CCNP Enterprise track, Ronnie is waiting for you in the library with all of these great topics for CCNA. In fact, Ronnie, I have to ask you, uh, I believe that there was quite a few episodes in your CCNA and uh, it came out to what, like close to 40 hours of training or something like that? It's a little bit about 30 plus hours uh, of training. So this actually did bring you from the kind of foundations that you needed uh, to ensure that you may have had, a, if you didn't have a background inside of maybe Cisco, also if you didn't have the strongest networking background, it went over some of those basic fundamentals. And then of course, deep dived into all that you needed to make sure that you also passed the exam as well as ready to work as a CCNA inside of the field as well. So this was a great series for us that we were actually able to demonstrate and of course uh, try and actually even do a lot of the things that you would normally have to do on a daily experience at working at a CCNA level. And one of the things that Ronnie did was he was very careful to title the episodes. So I'd like to make this suggestion too. Maybe if you feel strong in your foundation of Cisco in most of the areas, but you're a little concerned about a certain area that you haven't looked at in a long time, well, no problem. Take a look at the list of CCNA videos and just jump right into those where you would like a refresh. Right. Something else that is done, and Ronnie participated in this as well, is the DevNet Associate. So this was led by our resident DevOps guru, and that is Justin Dennison, and Ronnie assisted him with all his networking knowledge, and they did this incredible DevNet Associate course. In fact, it's a course that yours truly, I'm currently going through, and I'm absolutely loving that course. But this critical update is centered around this incredible news that we have for you, and that is, it's time, it's done, it's ready. You need to jump into the IT Pro TV library right away and you need to attack the Encore course. That is the Implementing and Operating Cisco Enterprise Network Core Technologies. This is such an important course in exam. This will give you your CCIE written. So when you pass Encore, you're ready uh, to schedule your CCIE lab after about 700 hours of studying, by the way. And then uh, we've also completed the NRC. So the most sought after, the most popular concentration exam, we've done it. We've completed the Implementing Cisco Enterprise Advanced Routing and Services course here at IT Pro TV, and that would give you your CCNP Enterprise. Now, Anthony, I, I like the way that we actually presented this particular uh, overall track itself because it actually gave us the time that even though we were working on it when the exam objectives dropped uh, you know, about six months ago or so, uh, we were actually already working on it. But then when the exams actually ended up dropping, you went in and actually took the exams, and that allowed us to kind of 
change a little bit of our perspective to understand what it is that we're really focusing on. So I think that was a great uh, uh, you know, decision for us as we actually continue through the courses. That's right. And, you know, you see some courses out there, Ronnie, and I'll be honest, they're just an obnoxious length, right? And what happens there is if instructors aren't taking these exams when they're releasing, they, of course, don't know really what to focus on. So you end up with this just massive catalog of information using kind of a shotgun approach. What we were able to do, yeah, is get right out. I think it was really interesting. I took the Encore exam the very day it released. That was, <laughs> I. you can tell I was waiting anxiously. Uh, so yeah, these, these courses, we were really able to focus on those key topics. And one of the things that you can see here as well that we're very excited about is if you want to have a more design-focused CCNP enterprise on your resume, no problem. You can go ahead and go down our uh, NSLED or 300-420 path as your concentration exam. And I'm about, uh, we're recording this at the end of May in 2020 for our YouTube followers. And I'm about two weeks away from completion there, so we can safely say the end slide will be fully built out for you in June of 2020. Now, uh, Anthony, with that, uh, we know that there's plenty of other concentration exam specializations uh, that are out there, but we chose these specifically because as we ended up looking at the CCIE, there's a big component that's right there in design, as well as, of course, uh, the stuff that we see in the NARSI. So I, I believe, Anthony, that that was kind of the reason why we actually ended up choosing that. So I'm glad that you're actually working on that even now. Yeah, absolutely. And, and you know, we really did know from decades of experience what would be the most popular concentrations. Right. And speaking of that, Ronnie, just a little teaser in this announcement as well, where you and I will be heading. Well, sure enough, we're heading to what is certainly the second most popular track. So Ronnie and I will get hard to work on that score, the core exam for the security track. And then we'll be looking at securing networks with Cisco Firepower and implementing secure solutions with VPNs. These two concentrations in the security track will be the most popular by far. So we'll get those done and in the library for you. Well, thanks for joining us in this critical update. We are so excited to have the CCNP Enterprise Track complete and ready to go for you here at IT Pro TV. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss these critical updates in the future.